You know what narcissists do? <laughs> they repeat Ben Davidson fucking lies and try to fucking confirm their bullshit with it. And it's like, God, dude. And uh, fucking, my zucchini is massive. It's massive. <laughs> Telling people they're out of energy and they're degenerate is fucking totally anti-creator. Crater sent us here to learn from our mistakes, and he doesn't hate us, and the entire fucking universe doesn't revolve around Lee touching his pee, pee I mean, if he would stop, it it might, might help things, but that's another subject for another day. Fucking the world is not running out of energy. Her magnet is not weak. Uh, it... <laughs> Tattooed Monkey has a big powerful magnet that he doesn't use in the Ferrocell because the less powerful magnets have more of a field to show off. And the more powerful ones buckle down like you would, you know, buckle down. It's got strength. It, it isn't so big. The thing is, if you got a shrinking magnet, it's stronger. And Earth's magnet is stronger. You, you were watching it power up huge closed field lines behind us and shit. All right. And being impressed into it by other planets and shit that you can see. You can fucking see at night. All y'all gone and looked. And if you haven't, you should go to your northern horizon and look at night. If you got a nice clear fucking view, where the hell are the stars? You know, look a little harder. There's a huge planet right behind you. They haven't told you about Where's Orion? Yeah, why is he there? <laughs> Shouldn't be able to see the Winter Hunter. Yeah, there's something going on. And it has something to do with our sun. But there's two other suns here. We live in a three sun system. And that's what they were writing on those walls from Peru to Giza. So, enjoy that. Crunch on it. And fucking hold us first. That's about all I got. Fucking... God doesn't hate you. God doesn't hate the universe that he created. That's some really small thinking shit. Don't make my creator that little. <laughs> Creation is immense and it's ever growing. The Bible that some people uphold came from the Anunnaki. I mean, I've posted up the cuneiform for fucking years. It's undeniable. You've heard the stories, Cain and Abel, and freaking Noah, and Gilgamesh, and the son of Noah, and all this stuff. The tablets of Toth. Toth says he's going to go down into the halls of many and sip on souls. <laughs> it's his birthright. Everybody wants to make him out to be some kind of hero. These people weren't to be worshipped, and they stole our identities from us. And they've hidden them from us. And they've been afraid that we'd come back and start reading our old language and understand us. And we have. What are, All these people running around talking about, oh, I'm not doing that anymore. I'm not going to go over there because all the fighting. Look, we found out something that I've given the world perpetual motion, perpetual energy, fucking the way planets actually work and your true soul in your magnet and broke it down in physics reverse engineer it from a damn genius hieroglyph we drew for ourselves a long time ago in a technical manner that's astounding if you don't uphold that as proof you don't understand what you're looking at IR spectrum it's quarter empirical with my thumbnail I could prove that Ra the Dingley Cobra the feathered serpent broke into the solar system and he's right up on your ass. He's ultraviolet sun, black light. You can't see his ass. You can see him in the clouds when it rains. He's pastel blue. Rainbow to purple, blue to purple. It ain't Roy G. Biv. It isn't Roy either, red, orange, yellow. 
Because that's the other fucking... That's the one you see most of. But sometimes, the right time of day, you'll see that third rainbow. That's Spectrum, people. Where the hell's the Roy in that? <laughs> that didn't happen. I know you all are seeing this. How many people listen to Lee that live in Hawaii? Oh, no, it's all good, man. My trees are great. I, w I would look around before you fucking start making any decisions. I'd stop looking at the screen and get out there and look at my damn moon. Is it doing cartwheels? Can I see fucking stars all over my north horizon? Why is that fucking big shadow there? Ask yourself. Where, where, why is Orion in the motherfucking sky? And been for a while. I don't know. Shouldn't be seeing that, should we? He's a winter hunter. So he should be on the other side of the sun. Anyway. Yeah, we're in those times. And we've been warning about every damn step of the way. And all I'm doing is getting flack. I used to legislate, advise legislators, write legislation, and legalize fucking hemp. I also fought against the core curriculum, that's funny enough. That's the first unanimous decision in North Carolina's entire legislature history. And then the hemp bill was passed 42 to 2. I do pretty good investigation, and I put it down on video and give it to you. If you can't look, that's not my fault. But you can't fucking fight the evidence if you haven't looked at it. If you see that, and a bunch of arrogant fucking claims, well, you might want to see that my name is Eric Sebastian Briggs. It's not Bernard. Paul. <laughs> These trolls start up when the land yacht here pulled out of Chad Daniels. Talking about how I'm a cokehead. I've already shown you where I was a junkie, but I ain't never rolled around and fought with cops and shit or had any charges. I didn't get out of control. And I was fucking decades ago. But my name still isn't Bernard. Derek Sebastian Briggs. Okay, <laughs> duh. I've given my DD 214s, and these people act like they know me. They don't. It's a concerted attack against the truth, and them watching us go knocking on doors and waking people up and shaking people up about their moon doing cartwheels off YouTube because it's reaching thousands everywhere we go they'll do anything to stop it <laughs> fuck them you got one of the golden tickets you don't want one of the golden tickets I've covered that. Sure is beautiful out here. Anyway, we got shit signal. So I'm downloading this video to everybody. Much love. I hope you have a good Monday. I'm going to be digging around. <laughs>